Have you ever wondered about the dark secrets hidden behind Hollywood's most iconic horror films? What eerie events unfolded on the sets of The Omen, Rosemary's Baby, and The Innkeepers? Join us on Ghostly Gazette as we delve into the chilling mysteries surrounding these classic movies. In the annals of Hollywood lore, few film productions have garnered as much fascination and speculation as The Omen, a chilling tale of demonic forces and supernatural omens. Yet behind the scenes of this iconic horror classic, a series of inexplicable and macabre events unfolded that left cast and crew shaken and led to whispers of an ominous curse befalling those associated with the film. The most harrowing incident involved Gregory Peck, the esteemed actor who portrayed the protagonist Robert Thorne. Peck and screenwriter David Seltzer were scheduled to travel to the United Kingdom for filming. Remarkably, both their flights were struck by lightning, one of the few flights in history to be hit in such a manner. Miraculously, both Peck and Seltzer survived, but this unnerving occurrence set the stage for a foreboding atmosphere around the film. Another haunting incident occurred offset and involved special effects consultant John Richardson. Following the completion of The Omen, Richardson and his assistant, Liz Moore, were driving in the Netherlands when tragedy struck. Their car collided with another vehicle, resulting in a fatal accident that claimed Moore's life. What added a chilling twist to this already grim turn of events was Richardson's claim that the accident eerily resembled a particularly gruesome death scene from the film, a detail that sent shivers down the spines of those familiar with the production. Amidst the supernatural whispers, even the animal actors seemed touched by a strange aura of menace. Baboons used in the film were handled by a zookeeper who later suffered a savage attack by a tiger shortly after production wrapped. This bizarre incident seemed to echo the film's themes of sinister forces at play. Furthermore, the Rottweilers employed in The Omen reportedly turned on their trainers during filming, exhibiting uncharacteristically aggressive behavior that mirrored the dark tone of the narrative. As word of these eerie happenings spread, rumors of a curse enveloped The Omen, some speculated that the film's subject matter centered around the Antichrist and supernatural forces had somehow invited malevolent energies onto the set. Others dismissed these events as mere coincidences, yet the sheer magnitude and strangeness of the occurrences cast a pall over the production. This morbid fascination with the so-called curse has persisted through the decades, adding an intriguing layer of mystique to the legacy of the omen. Despite the passage of time, the enigmatic events surrounding the omen continue to capture the imagination of film enthusiasts and paranormal aficionados alike. Whether attributed to chance or something more sinister, the chilling incidents that unfolded during the making of this seminal horror film remain etched in Hollywood history. Rosemary's Baby stands as a seminal work in the horror genre, but behind its chilling facade lies a series of unsettling incidents that have fueled speculation about a haunting curse associated with the film. Directed by Roman Polanski and based on the novel by Ira Levin, Rosemary's Baby delves into the sinister world of occult rituals and supernatural occurrences. However, the line between fiction and reality blurred during the film's production, leaving an indelible mark on those involved. One of the most tragic events linked to the film was the brutal murder of Roman Polanski's wife, Sharon Tate. Tate, who was pregnant at the time, was horrifically slain by the Manson family just a year after the release of Rosemary's Baby. This horrifying connection between the film's themes of pregnancy and the subsequent real-life tragedy added a disturbing layer to the perceived curse haunting the production. During filming, the cast and crew reportedly encountered numerous peculiar incidents. Mia Farrow, who portrayed the titular character Rosemary, claimed to receive eerie letters from strangers during production. These unsettling messages, coupled with the film's sinister subject matter, contributed to a growing sense of unease on set. Another chilling occurrence was the sudden death of composer Krzysztof Kometa shortly after completing the film's score. Kameda's passing was shrouded in mystery and underscored by rumors of a curse surrounding Rosemary's baby. 
His untimely demise further fueled the notion that the film was somehow cursed, a notion that persists to this day. The film's thematic exploration of Satanism and dark rituals seemed to bleed into reality during its production. In one disturbing incident, the iconic Dakota building in New York City, which served as the film's eerie backdrop, became forever linked to tragedy when John Lennon was tragically assassinated at its entrance years later. This macabre coincidence further cemented the association between Rosemary's Baby and unsettling real-world events. Decades later, the legacy of Rosemary's Baby continues to be shadowed by the enigmatic events that surrounded its creation. Whether the purported curse was a product of circumstance or something more insidious, the film remains a testament to the power of cinema to evoke primal fears and disturb the boundaries between fact and fiction. As long as tales of mysterious occurrences persist, the haunting specter of Rosemary's Baby will endure as a cautionary reminder of the eerie mysteries that can unfold both on and off the silver screen. The Innkeepers, directed by Ty West, is a modern horror film known for its chilling atmosphere and supernatural themes. Yet, behind the scenes of this indie gem, a series of peculiar events unfolded that added an unsettling layer to the film's production. As the crew delved into the eerie setting of the Yankee Peddler Inn, they found themselves entangled in a web of strange occurrences that mirrored the film's paranormal narrative. One of the most notable incidents involves strange noises and unexplained phenomena experienced by the cast and crew during filming at the actual Yankee Peddler Inn in Torrington, Connecticut. Reports emerged of doors slamming shut on their own, eerie whispers echoing through empty hallways, and inexplicable electrical malfunctions. These unsettling occurrences left the production team on edge, blurring the line between reality and the supernatural themes explored in the film. Adding to the mystique surrounding the innkeepers, lead actress Sarah Paxton recounted her own spine-chilling encounter during filming. Paxton claimed to have experienced a haunting presence in her hotel room, with mysterious shadows and unexplained sounds leaving her unnerved. This first-hand experience lent credence to the notion that the location itself was imbued with a sinister energy that seeped into the film's atmosphere. In a bizarre twist, the director Ty West reportedly edited the film in the supposedly haunted hotel where they had filmed, immersing himself in the same unsettling environment that had unnerved the cast and crew. This decision to embrace the eerie ambience of the Yankee Peddler Inn added a palpable authenticity to the film's depiction of supernatural dread. Following the release of The Innkeepers, viewers and skeptics alike speculated about the possibility of a curse associated with the film. While some dismissed the incidents as coincidental or exaggerated, others pointed to the tangible unease experienced by those involved in the production as evidence of a deeper, otherworldly influence at play. Regardless of one's belief in the supernatural, the eerie events surrounding the filming of The Innkeepers have left an enduring impression on both the cast and audience. As the film continues to captivate horror enthusiasts, the lingering mystery of what truly transpired during those fateful days at the Yankee Peddler Inn serves as a haunting reminder of the thin veil between the seen and unseen, the real and the spectral, in the realm of cinema and beyond. Thank you for joining us on Ghostly Gazette as we uncover the haunting mysteries behind these classic horror films. What do you think about these unsettling stories? Do you believe in curses or is it all just coincidence? Let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe to Ghostly Gazette for more spine-tingling tales and haunted histories. Until next time, stay curious and embrace the mysteries of the unknown.